Welcome to the first nighttime episode of Quest for the Golden Apple. If you want to see how I spend my nights, you know, putting my house together and building it, this episode is for you. But if you're just more interested in the adventure aspects, you can just skip to the next episode because I really don't do much here except build. Not that there's anything wrong with that. So first things first, I think what I want to do is have just a big glass floor. So I need to get a lot of this crap out of the way. Wood. Throw down the crafting table. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. A couple of chests. And just safely put this stuff away for now and then just grab what I need. I think the first thing I'm going to do is make a shovel and then head out into the desert and get myself... Or not even a shovel, actually. I'm going to make some torches and head out into the desert. Start getting the sand that I'm going to need to build a glass floor. And hopefully I can do this before any monsters spawn. I doubt I can get all of the... I'm going to need... Well, I don't know. It doesn't take that long to get sand. And it doesn't look like any monsters have spawned yet, so that's good. Ah, oh, I do dig down a lot. I think it actually is pretty safe to do it um, in, with sand, because... If something could drop straight down, then it usually would. I mean, it could be the type of sand that naturally spawns over air. And I'm pretty much just hoping it's not when I dig down inside of it. And one more stack. 64, alright. Hmm. Still no monsters. I'm liking this peaceful new world with its incredibly thick trees. Okay. Where's my furnace at? Furnace? And then some coal? I just eat through coal in this series. It is ridiculous. That should be good. In the meantime, I will get some... Uh, these are my... Okay. some new sticks, get some iron, probably even going to need another furnace, maybe even two more furnaces, but I'm just going to make a shovel for now. And do I have anything that can be used as temporary flooring? Not really, no. Okay. All that glass is going, I think I'm just going to start cleaning all of this mess up. As of right now, this is not the safest place to be spending the night. I could fall to my death or monsters could come up top, so I'm going to at least remove one of those threats and close off the top for now. With a torch so I don't forget where the top is. And look at that nice creepy cave sound. I imagine this is going to be my home for a while, which is why I'm spending so much time making it classy. Gla yeah, I get this glass and start filling in my floor. Okay. And I don't exactly know what I'm doing with it yet, if you couldn't tell. I'm just sort of figuring that out as I go. I've just never built a home at the top of a ravine, but still underground before. It just seems like a novel idea. Where's my clock at? I want to be able to head back out during the day, start looking for strongholds. Okay. Mm, fill in all that. I think I'll just make this a nice square room and have the glass cover just go through a corner. Make a nice cross section of dangerous fall to your death ravine covered only by a thin layer of glass. Okay. 
I use the click and release method to burn through the stuff faster. There we go. Fill that in. Have almost a nice square here. I just need to get rid of this stuff. And drop. Illuminate the entire cave. Make sure to block that off. Don't want that moonlight coming in. Um, I think what I'm going to do is clean this up for now. I need to start getting some cobblestone so I can make another furnace. Oh, you can go back. Yeah, which means I need to find a nice spot to dig up some stone from. Right here's fine. And this gravel, actually, is going to be my ticket to some arrowheads at some point down the road. Being kind of stingy with it for right now, but that's fine. That's 37. So now... I have enough cobblestone to make a few furnaces, which is going to help me a lot because I need to smelt down a lot of stuff, like some of that extra iron, some extra s uh, sand, right? Yeah, smelt down that sand. Split this coal up. More sand, more iron. Pop my bed down and sleep in that before. Oh, I missed my window. Okay. Oh, now I don't think I'm going to spawn here. I'll, I'll see how much floor I can get done here. And 20. Yeah. Okay. Five. Damn it. Damn it. That much. It's not going to take that much. This is not going to be built for people afraid of heights. Um, Morning is here. I'm going to put away all my building supplies. Let that stuff smelt. I'm going to grab what little wood I have. Sword. I guess I'm not going to need my bow. Food? Am I hungry at all? No. Weird. Really don't know how hunger works in this game. Thank you, cow. And I'm going to head you know, my sticks and my torches. Head out for the day and start day two of the hunt for the stronghold. <laughs>